questions. It appears we have two questions. We have one question about autoerotic asphyxiation and another can, a can? Another question? My brain just short-circuited like Bob just now. Yeah. It's all the NyQuil. And another question about pancakes. Fuck you guys. <laughs> really? That's it? All right. Yeah, I want to say the autoerotic asphyxiation was from Bill Necker. Mm -hmm. So, Bill. Um, John is going to explain his feelings on autoerotic asphyxiation. That was the question, right? Your feelings on it, or your thoughts on it, or your something techniques? along that line. Yeah. Okay, go. <laughs> um, it's fine if it's consensual. Right, right. It's good in moderation. Yeah. Um, it. Uh, but more than more than three times in a day is yeah. pushing it. Yeah. Well, ask Michael Hutchins. Mm. Who was the other dude that died from that? Um, the Carradine guy, right? It wasn't Michael Jackson. What? <laughs> Michael Jackson? <laughs> wow. No. The, uh, but yeah, autoerotic asphyxiation, um, I think, uh, the more the better, honestly. <laughs> Second question. <laughs> Do you like pancakes? Do you like, who was that sent by? That was from Nate. Oh, okay. Um, I do, I love pancakes, Yes. and I actually have a slightly revolting technique in which I eat pancakes, in which first I take said pancake. Oh, yeah, I forgot that you had this pancake story. Yeah, it's fucking gross. So I'll take pancakes, spread butter all over that, just everywhere, all up in that. Then I take sugar, like three or four packets, just douse the top of it with sugar. Then I throw syrup on the whole thing. And anybody who's actually sat with me when I've been eating that is so thoroughly repulsed. They're just like, Jesus, dude, really? <laughs> like, maybe the sugar... Are you sure about this, Chris? Like, are you sure about... you sure you want to do this, guys? But yeah, I love pancakes. How about you, John? I do love pancakes, too. Do you have a pancake story? Um... Hmm. So I love pancakes more than you, then. Clearly. Well... I don't know if Almost I as much as I love story. ginger ale. No good pancake stories come to mind. No. But I do have. I would enjoy oh, no. pancakes made by Mac Lethal. That's true. Yeah. I, and I do on occasion enjoy pancakes from hell, as sung, <laughs> yes. as sung by pancakes Lars Bakken. Pancakes from hell. <laughs> <laughs> Little shout out there. Um, but yeah, I, I want to say. Which you can it? check out on the first. Porto Creep CD. That's right, it's the hidden track, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah, I actually sang on that one, but the, the good version is the Lars Bakken version. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah. Um, was, wasn't there another question? Like, really, is that it? That's, That's legitimately really, it. Like, could we have gotten a more broad spectrum of questions? <laughs> like, hey, what's your influences? What kind of picks do you use? Autoerotic asphyxiation <laughs> of pancakes. Like, wow, that's fucking brilliant. Yeah, that pretty much sums up our fans. Yeah, that pretty much sums us up to a T, I think, yeah. actually. So, yeah. So, uh, keep them questions coming, folks.
I think I'd be a key grip. I think you'd be a you'd be a key grip, and I'd be a power bottom. <laughs> I think is what I'd be. Yeah. Yeah. Probably. 